So welcome back, welcome back. We are here with another episode of Hogwarts Legacy. And we are about to get the my we found about to get my signature move, man. I'm so happy about this. Well, it feels like I've been grinding for five hours for this one spell. Meticulous in your efforts. After all, shortcuts only ever lead to shortcomings. Get it? Cuts. Septum Sempra. Cuts. Ah. Ain't nothing short about this cut, though. Um. Yes, sir. Of course. Good. Ordinarily, I'd say it's not my concern either way. That thunder clap spell, whatever it's called, was actually really good. I should probably use it more often. Potent combination. It would be a shame to let that go to waste. Thank you, Professor. Don't let it go to your head. Now, let's see how you fare with Defindo. Wand at the ready. And he's a potion master just like Snape was. Over. That's why he's going to teach you fake sept Septim Sempra. No, no, no. This is the one for me. That's right. It's time. We got it, boys. Hmm. Very good. It seems you have a grasp on Defindo. I would encourage you once again to practice here in the classroom. For your sake and that of everyone else. All right. Well, let's do some practicing. So I'm going to put this on my main. And then on two, I'll put Expelliarmus. And then on three, I'll put Confringo. Actually, yeah, Confringo's fine. Three. Oh, wrong one. Actually, no, I like that. Yeah, put both fire spells on one. That's a great idea. If I ever need repair, I'll just go that route with it. Okay, cool. So, now. It's a pleasure to have a student who actually heeds instruction. Now I need to go ahead and get my talents centered around this. If I if I can build a a build around it, I could, I would, but I don't think I can. Um, all right, so that was the last core spell or last level five spell. All right, I got two more left. Oh wow, that's scary. Okay. Let's do that's dope. Breaks enemy shields. This is just like a better flow. I might get both of those. Allow me to be more uh aggressive. Yeah. I'm not spiking hard in the ancient magic so far. But I think we'll get well efficient. 
flippancy is a good idea for now. Because I don't want to spend my entire life. Actually, when I run out of potions, I'll worry about that. Okay. I only got to create a new save slot, but I'm not going to for this. I'm just going to keep pushing. The reason I'm not going to create a new save slot is because the last one was just like really 20 minutes game time for this. So, Alright, cool. Now I've got three main quests I can do. As well as some assignments. Let's go get that done. Oh, need here I come. Welcome back. I've arranged a special price on the broom upgrade for you. I truly appreciate all of your <laughs> 1000 is your special price? <laughs> Alright, we'll talk later, Thanks bro. Thanks for stopping by. Hope to see you again. Uh, that's trash. You gotta like it when a game keeps you in perpetual poverty, though. Like, it makes you get really creative about how you spend your money and how you make money. Alright, um... So, we're not going to do that quest right now. And while I'm at it, honestly, I could use uh, the other classroom. I had like a single pot, right? Hold up. I'll just put it here for now. Start growing some mandrake. Actually, I'll put mouse sweet in this one. And mandrakes in this one.
I just only need so much mallow sweet, so I'm not too worried about. Like, I collect. Like, four harvests of that, I'll be. Oh, wait. Well, I'm still in this room. I collect, like, four harvests of mallow sweet, I'll be fine, I think. Uniform cape. Yeah, we love Nice to see you, my young friend. Actually, this is the perfect timing. Let's do this. I don't even know how to bury their head in the ground. Rebellion. Hello, let me see if they'll tell me how to do it. What a stupid. Cost Wait, I did, it worked. I did it. What a stupid. I definitely buried his head in the ground. Careful. 
Incendio. There we go. entire town of ops gigantic camp hold up yeah, I think I'd have to go fight the ops in order to get that one There's something over there. These rocks have seen better days. When you have a cloak like that, you can blame the cloak. So much stuff in the world. They need those little uh, question marks like Witcher has. Although that would be super annoying now that I think about it. I think about oh, how Skellige was. Yeah, that kind of sucked. Because then you're like, oh, I got to see all the question marks. Because you don't know what's like important and what's just an item. Shoot, just finishing out Velen was a really annoying process. Here we are. go oh, I miss that's it All right, that should make her happy um
I don't think I have all three combat plans available at this point in time. I'm pretty sure I don't. Like, I'd waste them on my mandrakes. That's why I'm growing a new one. Actually, there's a fast travel point nearby, ain't it? This way. This looks intriguing. All right, and from here we'll just go back to Hogwarts. I forgot which area it is. It's like this area, though. No, no. It's this one. Right here. Welcome back. Have you finished your assignments? Reporting back, Professor. Assignments all finished. Well done. Shows good discipline. Wisdom is a golden snitch, as they say. And you're proving a skilled seeker in that regard. Let us practice our restore momentum. A charm, incidentally, created to stop quaffles from plummeting straight to the ground during a Quidditch match. Precise, deliberate movements. Very good. I recommend practicing your new spell as much as possible. Perhaps you... Arrest of Momentum. Hmm. Where would I want to put something like that? I think often I end up worrying most about my, yeah, it's, I'm usually most worried about my damage, so I'll put that on one. And on two, I'll put... Rest on Momentum. I can stop them and throw them away. Arrest them. That's it. Keep it up. Okay. Yeah. Solid. Where's the map? <laughs> oh, 
Hopefully those plants are almost done by now. This is done. All right. Now, in these circumstances, I want to go to roadmap. Apparently I went pretty far to the east there. I just didn't pick up anything. No, I did pick up something. I completely missed this. There's a couple other things I could have picked up too. Rookwood Castle. Yeah. Actually, I know the perfect time. I know the perfect quest to do this on. I'll use it on the quest where I'm probably going to have to fight some Dark Wizards anyway. So, Brothers Keepers. Alright. And then from there, we'll go up here. Back to the North Fort Bog. What are you up to now? Guess I have to save then, because it didn't know how to save for me. Investigate. I'm pretty sure these guys are just they're immune to everything except for uh If I'm not mistaken, these guys, the Fury are zombies that are immune to everything except for, uh... Alright, so you need s Okay, let's try this out.
make some more thunder. Thunder, thunder, thunder cat. Oh, there were fire barrels. That's how I was supposed to get past it. Wait, can I Akio that? Oh, I can't stuff it in the bag though. That's fine. This could prove dangerous if I'm not careful. mentions in theory and something about it being Bardo's turn next oh that sucks choose your friends wisely guys or you get turned into a uh, <laughs> a zombie Where's the blow? There it is. Oh, they do glow.
Lots of nat nature over here. It's pretty neat. Yeah, that's pretty neat. Is that a dragon? It looks like a freaking dragon. Let's let her know that her brother is dead dead. You can't imagine how inconvenient travel was before I invented sleep hacking. If it weren't for the cost of sleep Oh, I do hope my brother is alright. Madam I'm about to break your heart. I do have some news of your brother. Oh, please tell me he's safe. I regret to say that Bardolf had been turned into an inferior, and I had to kill him. What? But, but how could you possibly think that an inferior was my brother Bardolf? That's absurd. He was wearing a woolen jumper, hand knitted. <gasps> no, no, this can't be. I'm truly sorry. Dang. I wish it had been better news. I wish you well, Madam Bubbled. <laughs> what more could I have done? <laughs> oh, Bardolf. Bardolf, my dear, dear brother. What are the quests we got? I've managed to spend the entire, like, last two hours not doing any main quests, and it's amazing. Oh. Cool. I don't know what we did for this, but we got it. Oh, where's my gear at? 18. Like, I still have room for, like... 10 more. Professor Garlic is in the library annex. No, that's the wrong way. She's in the grand staircase. It's fine, though. It's not that much of a setback. Not another grand staircase either. It's not the library annex, is it just Great Hall? No. Oh yeah. Okay, they're both in the library. I don't know why I thought potions and uh herbology were in different spots. Off on another adventure, are we? Of the metric. Thank you. Where's she actually at? Finish the activities you assigned me, Professor Garlic. Wonderful. I hope you gained a greater appreciation for the flora in our lives. I am forever enraptured by it. 
Just yesterday, I spent hours pruning my self-fertilizing shrubs and flutterby bushes. Didn't realize how long I'd been at it until the sun began to set. Well, if there's one thing I love to see more than my plants thriving, it's one of my students doing the same. Now, ready to learn flippendo? Chin up, keep a light grip, and it's all in the wrist. Let's see you give it a go. You will want to focus with this spell. Nothing as mortifying as knocking back a colleague when all you wanted to do was move a few pots. I wish the fennel was that easy, where I didn't even have to really think about how I was getting it. Wonderfully done. If you'd like to practice a bit more, you're welcome to do so here in the greenhouse. Just mind the plants, please. So Flipendo is like hmm. It's kinda like a juggle move. That makes sense. Greenhouse won't keep itself in order without a nudge from me. I think it is actually pretty quick. Yeah, I could just go... Or how about... I just go flip it, damage, and then do more, do more work from there. But why would I just use Akio the same way? If it's only one opponent, I get real funky with it. Real funky with it. 
that's assuming the opponent isn't trying to kill me too. If they're trying to do something, then yeah, all those combos go out the window. All right, so next. Fine. Let's look at what gear we got. Stuff. Nope. I hate this unidentified thing. Like, they shouldn't have done this. That was a dumb idea. I got a good scarf out of that. Literally sounds identical to The Witcher when you're in uh, Novigrad. Like that first five seconds of the song, at least. I do want to. I honestly do want to look up if you can, if legendary items are one of a kind, or if I can find more of them, because that's what's holding back a lot of my earning potential right now. Is not having legendary items being sold. All right, so we got. Pulse. Let's talk to Serana. It's the lowest level quest. Hello there, nice to see you. I was trying not to deal with this person again, but it is what it is. <sighs> Hello, Miss Ryan. I wanted to thank you again for your help with Rookwood and Harlow the day of the troll attack. Serona. And I was happy to help. Those two are nothing but trouble. Glad you and your friend were here when they found you. I am too. You were speaking to a goblin here that day. Yes, Lord God. <laughs> He's a friend. It seems as though you were on good terms with him. I've known him for years. We met when I was waiting tables here as a student, well before I bought the place. He was cordial enough, but we weren't friends then. His mistrust of wizard kind ran deep. But you're friends now. We are. I hadn't seen him in the <coughs> when he came in a few months ago, but he recognized me instantly, which is more than I can say for some of my own classmates. It took them a second to realize I was actually a witch, not a wizard. Not all goblins are like Ranrock and his loyalists. Lodgok is as worried as the rest of us about what's been going on. 
In that case, I'd like to talk with him, about Ranrock in particular. Where might I find him? I assume your interest is to do with the rumours I've heard about Ranrock working with our friend Rookwood. It is. If he's not here, you might find him doing business at the Hog's Head. He's a trusted metal trader. You should mention that we spoke. He can, understandably, be wary of witches and wizards. Even ones as young as you. That said, if you're looking for information on Ranrock to help rein him in, you'll find an ally in Lodgok. Have you heard what Ranrock and Rookwood are working on together? Not much more than the fact that they seem to have some sort of uneasy alliance. Friendship between wizards and goblins is rare enough, but between those two, they each want something the other has. I can guarantee it. That said, I fear they're like a two-headed serpent. Both will need to be taken down to stop whatever scheme they've been plotting. You seemed unfazed by Rookwood and Harlow the other day. They don't scare you. They're bullies, plain and simple. Never tolerated them in my own life, and certainly won't tolerate them going after my friends. Don't misunderstand me. They're dangerous wizards and shouldn't be trifled with. They should, however, be confronted and reminded, whenever possible, that the rest of us have each other's backs. Thank you, Serena. I didn't listen to any of that conversation because I don't care. Please All right. Give him my best. Let's go. I don't know what you've done to make such powerful enemies. But please, watch your back. Can I open this door? Thank you. <laughs> All right, across the town Good we to go. See you, outside the castle. you too, I meet. Yeah. Welcome to the Ogs Head. Any empty seat is yours. Hello, Lord Gok. Sorona said I might find you here. She did, did she? Did she send you with news? No, actually, I wanted to speak with you. It's about Ranrock. Now I remember. The three broomsticks. Day of the troll attack. You're the student he's after. I am. And I need to know what he and his loyalists are up to, so I can stay a step ahead. Let's say I did know. Why should I trust you? Sorona said our interests may be aligned. Perhaps she was wrong. Hmm. Well, if Sorona believes we have common goals, then it is possible that we can trust each other. Very well. I may know of something that could help us both. A way to get Ranrock to confide his plans to me. I'm listening. Years ago, a heinous witch stole a sacred goblin relic. Rumor has it that it now rests in her sarcophagus, in a tomb accessible only by wizard kind. Ranrock and I had a, a falling out a while back. The relic could well repair the chasm between us. Very well. I'll retrieve the relic if you promise to share Ranrock's plans with me. We will have to trust each other. I, that you will not abscond with the relic, and you, that I'll share what I learn. Gather whatever supplies you may need, and meet me near the witch's tomb. <laughs> okay. Well, if that's the case, then... <laughs> What I'm going to do is I'm just going to call this episode right here, right now. I know it's going to be shorter than most of the episodes I've made, but I also want to go grab something for lunch. So, yeah, I'll catch you next time. I'll probably make one more today. Probably stream it during the Super Bowl. So, yeah, peace and chicken grease. I've been me. You've been awesome. Bye.